Okay, so this is the first video that I'm recording on Modern Warfare. It'll probably be the first to go up, but I'm not sure. Um, I forgot to record my very first games yesterday. I played all day. Um, yesterday was Thursday. I'm recording this on Friday. Just got home from school, switching to my pajamas because I'm going to be staying up all night. I'm going to be playing all weekend, so I'll be grinding on recording videos when I can. I'm going to get as many as I can recorded to spread out throughout the next month while we're waiting for Modern Warfare to release. So far, I love the game. And now, today... They added the night vision game mode, which I'm probably going to play today, because it's new and I only did one match of it. And, but I'm, it seems alright, but I just wish they would have swapped it out with cyber attack, because cyber attack I'm not a huge fan of. But gunfight, I loved. I love 2v2 gunfight. It was such a good game mode. I'm already max level, level 20, but they're probably going to raise that tomorrow when the beta goes live. So the it'll probably be raised from 20 to 30, so... I have all the weapons, I have the M4, the MP5, MP7, M13, um, and so and such. So, the, we're going to be playing the night version game mode, and we're going to be having some fun, and I'm going to try to just play as much as I get, as much, you know, content as I can this weekend. I'm going to try a whole bunch of different challenges and stuff. Um, I haven't even sniped in this game yet. I used a sniper once, but I died instantly and just ended up switching back over. Um, I do have some clips from my first, my, like, first day of playing, which I'll probably make into a video so I can show you guys all my awesome clips that I hit. And, uh, yeah, so if you guys do enjoy this video, be sure to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, turn on the notification to be notified when I upload another Modern Warfare video and when I upload another video in general. I make gaming content, a uh, new video every week, speaking of which, I got, I don't have a video set up for this this uh wednesday which kind of sucks so i'm probably gonna be running the mp5 on this map so you spawn in and it's gonna you can have the night vision off but i like having it on and certain weapons you can ads certain weapons you you just aim off to the side oh oh he flashed me what hold on only thing is, they can- Aw, oh, damn. See, you can see the laser sights, which is pretty interesting. So that when you're pre-aiming around a corner, people will know you're aiming, and they can probably estimate just about where you are. Something else I found really cool is when you're climbing a ladder, you can shoot. Like, right now, I'm climbing the ladder. You can see. And I can still shoot, which is pretty cool. He's around there. Oh, yikes. Another one around here. I was behind the card. That's been happening to me a lot recently. I'll be shooting. Is he not using night vision? That's weird. Um, I'll be I'll be going around the corner, and as I'm behind, I'll still die. Of course, it's probably bound to change. Most of the stuff in the beta is bound to change. He's over there. I'm just trying to pre-fire. I have a pretty decent setup on the MP5. I have so far I have the regular the mini reflex sight, which is still for my favorite, but I do want to see what this holographic sight looks like on it. I have a tactical suppressor, an angled foregrip, which I really want to unlock a regular, like vertical grip if I can. I have extended max, but I want there's another um like even more extended magazine that I want to unlock. I don't have a laser, but I have this perk. Uh, bullets call, are called target healing to be briefly delayed, but I actually just unlocked FMJ, so I'm going to put on FMJ on it. So, I have a pretty decent, like, class going on with the MP5. I might try to make, like, a class setup video on, like, a really good class setup that I personally enjoy. Because every, every attachment, ah, damn, every attachment really matters. So, like, uh, I just leveled up to rank 15. Did I unlock the new mags? No, I didn't. They unlock anything new. No. Uh, one more level and I'll get that new holographic sight. And you can change the attachments in-game. Which is something that Call of Duty has never done before. Now, another thing that I really wanted to do. So, my computer, you like it could handle the 1080p quality of my videos. But I didn't want to keep pressuring it because it was taking a lot out of my system. So, and the videos just kind of looks like fuzzy and stuff. So, I downgraded to 720p 60fps. So I hope it doesn't look too bad. I think this might be the first... Of, no, the Rocket League... Oh, damn. The Rocket League video was the first video that I uploaded 
at 720p 60 fps if you guys want to go see that just go to my recent uploads and it should be there or just go to my funny moments playlist and uh you'll see it There's one on. I couldn't. I couldn't craft in time. I knew someone was gonna come from that window, but right when I turned around is when they came, for some odd reason. Maybe UAV, so I'll call that in. This MP5 is really nice, and I still haven't gotten a nuke yet. I did drop a massive kill streak on my first game, but I've. If I'm gonna be honest, that was probably just me being lucky. I probably just got a bad, like lobby, because these like this game is. Like it has skill-based matchmaking, so I was pro I was with new people, and but I've never really like I'm not too bad, but I've never been so bad at a Call of Duty game like ever in my life. It's honestly mind blowing how bad I do at this game. And I think it's because it feels so different with the new engine. It like barely even feels like a Call of Duty game if I'm gonna be honest. It feels like a mixture of Splinter Cell and well not Splinter Cell. It feels like a mixture of Rainbow Six Siege, and Battlefield. Oh, I'll get turned on. I'm laying down. God, I can't see anything. I thought there would be more light in here. Oh, damn. He rushed up. I didn't even realize I rushed up. We won, though. But I was throwing the flashbang. I was going to wait for him to get flashed, but he ended up pushing off. That, wow. Oh, okay. Ah, damn. And I, you know, it kind of sucks because I forgot to make a video on the 2v2 gunfight mode yesterday, but I love it. I'm hoping that it returns back to the beta, but I doubt it. So, but tomorrow, the ground war 32v32 player... Uh, game that comes out, of course, by the time these videos go up, the beta will already be over, so I can definitely record the Ground War game, like my first game on the Ground War, because it's supposed to be kind of like Battlefield, in a sense to where you can just hop in helicopters as you wish, like, you know, freely, and you can hop in just any vehicle, any time that you want. And it's just massive maps, so I'm really excited, and I'm hoping it flows well. I'm hoping it's not completely empty like most of these maps are, because these maps seem way too big. Whoa, where is he? Ah, I saw him, but I'm not. I'm gonna hop off the MP7. I'm gonna switch to the M13. M13's a good gun. Honestly, one of my favorites here. The M13 actually shreds, and the Deagle. This is probably the best feeling Deagle that I've ever used in any Call of Duty game. Excuse my bad aim. I love how you can aim down sights. Like, I love how you can ADS while you're reloading. Probably one of the coolest, like, small features that I've seen them add. And then I love to do when I'm coming out of this well. I love coming up here peeking with the... Eagle, because especially when they're coming from their spawn here, you, they won't see you coming. <laughs> and you're basically head glitching, so. But once you run out of ammo, you know, you run out of ammo, so. it's You can only do it for just a little while before you start running out of ammo, because you can't reload while you're on the ladder. But right there, literally two shots with the deagle in the body, and they're dead. If it's a headshot, it's a one-hit kill. So, you can easily just, like, build up streaks, especially there, because you're, because you're head glitching. And head glitching is kind of key in this game, whether it's mounting on these things, or just hide, hiding down, or whatever, just getting in a good spot. Because people, right now, they cannot control the recoil, and I'm gonna be honest, I really can't either. But the recoil of these guns, I wouldn't say next level, but they're, like, increased. 
not a lot of people can control them because it's just a new feel to the gun. So when you're head glitching and they need that precise aim, they're most likely going to need tap fire. But they're not going to think about tap firing because they can't control the weapon in the first place. I'm going to go around. I'm going to see if I can flank them. Damn, he came behind me too fast. I thought I was going to I was going to try to what is he doing? I was going to try to switch to a deagle and turn on him, but I I, cause I thought he was way more back in their spawn. I'm pop the cruise missile real quick. There's some open targets. There's two kills. I hear him. There's a dude walking over here. I'm gonna switch to M4. This I can ADS because of the certain sight that I have on it. So the M4 is a really well balanced gun. Like yeah, it's powerful, but there's also other stuff that can easily counter it. Cause the MP5 that's the most overpowered gun in the game right now. So we we won that. Did I get the last kill? No. I don't think I did. No, I didn't. Okay. So I'm sorry if for some reason the green agitate you guys. I was doing a video on the night vision mode. This might be the first video that goes up Wednesday. I'm not quite sure. That's if a video even goes up this Wednesday because I'm recording this on a Friday. So next Wednesday, that's if a video even goes up. I'm not sure if I'll be able to get one done because of school and everything. So if it doesn't, then sometime next week it will definitely go up. So, that is the night vision mode in Modern Warfare. If you guys did enjoy, be sure to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and turn on notifications to be notified every time I upload another video like this one. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys later.